What's up? This is Quad 24 day We're following Sunday to 17 Modern View. Today we'll be taking a look at a few cars, plow truck, semi truck, logging truck, mini flatbed, and a few trailers. Up first, we'll be taking a look at a 1970 Dodge Charger RT. This thing looks pretty cool. It has a very large air take coming out of the hood. Awesome paint job. Do like all the chrome all the way around. You guys can see awesome looking muscle car wheels. As you come around to back, you guys can see there's a lot of chrome all over. Over, chrome gas cap and around the back dual exhaust out of it which is pretty cool once you hop on the inside this goes 152 miles per hour now it does have turn signals they do not flash but all of the lights do work on it which is pretty cool up front you guys can see it does have LED headlights very cool upgrade and you guys can see there's the engine underneath the hood which is pretty cool on the inside view it does have an interior view but it does need a lot of work it needs working steering wheel, working mirrors and overall very detailed one so we'll be turning this on taking it for a spin. It has pretty realistic muscle car sounds, which is pretty cool. And the handling of this is awesome. And let me know down below in the comments what types of videos you guys would like me to do with all of these mods. Overall, one very cool old muscle car. Up next, we'll be taking a look at a 2006 Pontiac. This thing looks pretty cool. It is a coupe. Pretty cool wheels on it and overall looks awesome with a pretty small air intakes on the hood. But once you hop on the inside, this goes 152 miles per hour. Very large exhaust out of back of it. Guys, can see it does have turn signals. Uh, working lights, no reverse lights, does actually have a license plate light, and take a look at that front, that looks pretty cool. Now on the inside view, it does need a pretty detailed one, but we'll be taking this for a spin and seeing how this handles, and I really do like how we get a variety of cars in Farming Sim, which is pretty cool, and I do appreciate all the support on all these mod reviews, and if you do have any cool mods you guys would like me to feature, let me know down below in the comments. Up next, we'll be taking a look at a plow truck, it's a Chevy Silverado 4x for and it does have a plow mount and inside of a pack it does have the boss plow you will have to unzip it and also it does have a pretty cool one single beacon light up top but it looks like this is overall a pretty cool truck very nicely done on the detail the turn signals do work you guys can see it does have working lights all the way around pretty cool I mean the wheels look pretty cool blacked out and you guys can see one beacon light now on the inside view it does have an interior view it's Pretty detailed, might need a little bit more work to get a little bit more detail working steering wheel and mirrors. But overall, this is one pretty cool plow truck, and you guys can see the plow does work since it does have the plow mount. So we'll be taking this for a spin. You guys can see it also does have a pretty cool exhaust out of the back, also. And overall, I'm very excited for winter coming, and there should be a lot more plow trucks coming out very soon, also, which should be pretty cool. We'll turn this vehicle off, turn off the beacon light, and I think we'll be adding a few beacon lights to some other plow trucks. Up next, we'll be taking a look at this very large semi-truck. Take a look at the front. I mean, this bumper looks pretty cool. It does have the protection. Pretty nicely done. Almost has the in-game cab on it with the extension. Pretty cool exhaust. Around back, it's a tri-axle semi-truck, which is awesome. Very large. You do have the option for this bumper pull hitch and a few other options in the store when it comes to the engine, everything like that. So it does have turn signal signals, reverse lights, turn signals, everything like that in the front. You guys can see this thing looks awesome. I mean, take a look at that. All of the lights do work. Now on the inside view, working steering wheel, working mirrors, and overall awesome. It looks like the in-game one, very similar, and you guys can see pretty cool seats. So we'll be taking this four spin. This has a top speed of 63 miles per hour. Overall, this is one very fast truck, and I really do like it a lot. It looks pretty cool. Now, there's a lot of body roll, and it looks like you do have a little bit of trouble turning, and it almost wants to kind of turn around very fast for you. But overall, that could be helpful at times, and the back wheels do come off the ground when you do turn. Up next, we'll be taking a look at an international log truck. This is pretty cool. It looks like an older international with a log truck bed on it to put some wood, and I really do like the old rustic trucks for the logging. Pretty realistic. You guys can see it does have brake lights no bumper pull hitch but I do like the wheels and you guys can see the frame on the truck looks awesome also once you hop on the inside it goes 26 miles per hour it does have one turn signal working it looks like the brake lights do not work but in the front you guys can see pretty cool headlights and up top those orange lights look awesome now on the inside view it does have a working steering wheel it does need working mirrors and working gauges but overall it's a good start on the inside view and it you guys can see that there are the handles and the seats so we take this four spin in the 
exhaust comes out underneath the truck, which is pretty cool. And then you have the uh, gas tank on the left side. So we'll be taking this for a spin. This is one pretty slow truck, but as you guys can see, when you do move around, the second turn signal does work. And uh, the turning radius on this is also not the best, but it's an older truck, which is pretty realistic for you all to kind of do some logging on. And we might add this, so let me know down below in the comments what types of videos you guys would like me to do with all of these mods. I really do like doing mod reviews. These are pretty cool, showing off all these uh, awesome mods made by some pretty cool mod creators. Up next, we'll be taking a look at this mini flatbed. This is pretty cool. It comes with this and this mini trailer to go along with it. You could attach this to really any uh, equi equipment, even like a mini tractor, which is pretty cool. It does have a bumper pull hitch in the back of both. I really do like the wood texture on this. You guys can see I did do all of the working straps. Now, now, pretty nice wheels on this and overall the cab looks pretty cool once you hop on the inside goes 26 miles per hour working turn signals everything does work on it I mean take a look at this first person view working gauges working mirrors that is awesome so we'll be attaching and I mean this is a pretty cool small vehicle to kind of go around on the farm or even we could probably use this for some landscaping so let me know what should we use this for I think that this would be a pretty cool vehicle to use along with uh, some pretty cool uh, farming or something like that but up next you guys can see we have a homemade water trailer this looks pretty cool looks like it's a fertilizer tank on a very very small trailer looks awesome and you guys can see it does have a uh, pretty cool fertilizer a lot of detail but no working lights on it so I hope you guys enjoyed today's mod review all the links will be down below in this description have a great day and subscribe for more